Uh, we'll probably have a couple of them. We give our uh, penguins vitamins because the fish that we give them is quick frozen and odd. They kill off parasites that way. Unfortunately, live fish can bring in parasites. Don't want to pass that on to your uh, uh, healthy birds. So we give them a vitamin because in doing that, we're also killing off nutrients. So what we do then is to make sure that we to get the vitamin every day. Believe it or not, there is a vitamin company that actually makes a vitamin. All right, guys, it's getting very noisy in here, and it's getting a little difficult to see, but I don't want to yell at everybody. So if you have questions, you're welcome to come over. feeding on Is anybody wondering why this one hasn't gone over? Eating their fishies and then they're walking away. Yeah. All right. They have food regulating first. Okay. They know when they're hungry. They know when they've had enough to eat. Um, sometimes what will happen if we have a penguin that has uh, bulked up on food before it moves? Uh, but they're not going to be hungry that it's food. Uh, sometimes you have birds that uh, it's kind of crazy in front of the bucket right now. You know, like there are a lot of them that even have their head in the bucket. So some of them are a little bit more reserved and they kind of wait until all of the craziness dies down and then they will come over. Look at the one that just chilling in the middle. Don't think you have any multi-birds at the time. It's spicy with that one. But that's why we have somebody who can do that. Because if you have a bird that is not eating at the feet, you don't know about that as well. And then you can get the bed involved and do what you have to do. So they all have their particular favorites. We have to make sure we keep track of what kind of fish they eat. Uh, when you're doing food prep, we want to make sure that there are enough fish of all kinds in there to satisfy the whole thing. And of course, we have to look to see if somebody's eating more than usual. Oh, yep, yeah, fire to the bowl. Or in the case of a sentient fish, we want to Look at him, look at him. Oh, God, he's trying to swallow it. Oh. It's interesting because you see something that you're just washing it. Oh, God. I don't understand how we eat that. I like to say there's no overfeeders in the world. Oh, God, they're all running away now. Oh, God. Guys, it's going to be very, very busy today. Uh, the schools are out, as you all know, so make sure, make sure your children stay with you. Make sure they're within, the, within view at all times. They, they it's like a baby. Oh, it's a cool thing. Oh, it's a cool thing. Oh, it's a <laughs> All right, so we have a number of penguins that apparently they're very satisfied with what they have this morning. Probably several of those that have their heads in the bucket. And then we'll go over there and try to cluster. I know it disappoints people sometimes because they want to keep the penguins in the water. Remember that penguins spend in their natural habitat. They spend their entire day foraging for food. Well, these penguins get fed twice a day by hand, so there really isn't any need for them to go into the water. They will go into the water for, oh, somebody just dropped something on the floor, a bottle. Uh, yeah, right by your left foot. Um, I know, look at him. 
So when they're doing the swimming, it's for recreational. Did you go? Or it's uh, when they get into the water and rolling around in the water and doing this with their feathers and getting into that. It's all nice and wet. So those are about the only times you see it. Okay, what else did everybody have to eat on the floor? The window. Yeah, that's just the window fill, and it's not really meant to hold you. They kind of. Okay, Mommy also has South African penguins. Our South African penguins are outside. And they are fed at 11 15. Hey guys, all of you on the floor, please. All of you on the floor, It looks like there's some of the penguins have had their fill of breakfast this morning. We have some that are still uh, hanging out there and uh, looking for more. Yeah, very important today. We're going to be very, very busy. Schools are closed. Uh, so we're going to do it all the way over the floor. And uh, especially the little ones, we don't want to do it up there. We're going to be very busy. We're going to be very busy. We're going to be very busy. Thank you. 
Turtle. Yeah, a red rainbow fish in here. Turtle, Helen. I wonder how long his neck is. That's a oh, little stinker turtle. turtle. Oh, sorry. Common snake neck turtle. But they say little snake stinkers. Look Common how snake long his neck is. That's so water. cool. They are known to move great distances to find suitable habitat. Locals call